from Kicking World. Brent, I, I'm a big fan of your work, and I appreciate you joining the show. Thank you. Hey, Snoop, thanks for having me on, man. We've been following each other for a while, and yeah. so I'm stoked to talk with you for a little bit. <laughs> and let me tell you, I had, I had like a lot more uh, handcuffs at the other place, so, you know. Yeah, uh, right. But anyway, uh, man, I see you working with the best of the best in the Austin area as far as the kicking game is concerned. Can you kind of uh, explain like how you cultivate those relationships with the best? Absolutely. So I'm originally from Jersey, and I found my way uh, here in Texas only about five years ago, but we've been doing it 13 years, and I, 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 I fell in love with Cedar Park area, and I got in with, with Coach Vincent over at uh, Vista Ridge and Coach Cheatham at Round Rock and Coach Wood at Westwood, and they sort of helped me get set up in the area, and we've been working with a lot of the best kids, and we do, like, instruction teaching you know there's a lot of sports camps i heard you talking about ranking earlier there's a lot that just like take down stats and stuff but we actually help them with their fundamentals and that's really important no matter how good or how bad you are you got to get right with the technique you know yeah and as far as far as kicking in in this area i know it's it's not something that like people are, are looking up the best kickers in the area and things like that so it's not a lot of shine these guys get what what are some names in terms of kickers in this area that people should be on the lookout for Absolutely. Um, I was writing down some names before I called, so I'm ready for that question. <laughs> good, 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 Brent. <laughs> for, you got it. <laughs> <laughs> so right in the heart of Austin, I got some other guys on the outskirts, San Antonio, Dallas and stuff, but right yeah. in Austin, our two top dudes, for sure, the guy you always talk with, with the wolf pack over at Cedar Park. Justin Boar. Moore, 20, yeah. You got ah. to do big up on him. And then 2022, sort of a new blood coming in that's only been with me for about – two years but he grew real quick and he's over at one of the parochial deals taps regions will stone he's only going to be a tease of 2022 will so stone. those are my top two picks for straight austin area yeah and I, and I think the the austin area like kicking scene if you will is really on the up and up with with guys like uh oscar degreesovich at, at uh washington state punting i mean he's a ray guy award watch oh, list yeah he went over to where georgetown right uh, yeah, Huddle. he's from Huddo and, and went to and you know he's at Washington Huddle, State. Huddle, Huddle. Yeah, that's right. And everybody yeah. knows Cameron cool. Dicker. You got uh, Alex Stadhouse, mm -hmm. who's at USC. So in terms of like finding and kind of molding these guys, are 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 much of them like coming and wanting to jump straight into kicking, or are you trying to like kind of reach out to soccer guys, or how do these kids get into kicking? Yeah. No, that's a great question. I'd say probably seventy percent of the dudes we work with played at least a few years on soccer. So you really, you really got to have good balance and good motor skills. A lot of people think, you know, unfortunately, a lot of parents are like, oh, I'm just going to turn my, morph my son into a kicker because I'm afraid of getting him hurt. But it don't work like that. You know, you have to be really coordinated, hand-eye coordination type of deal, but like a baseball player, but just like with your foot for kicking. So it, there's a lot of details uh, to follow, and I, I'd say – yeah, most of the kids are either soccer or just really gifted and being able to have full control over their body and get that foot to where they need to, to the ball. Yeah, Brenton. We got some big hitters, too. I start, um, I meant to say, um, Go ahead. you were talking about those other schools. So I got a kid, he's not technically Austin, but I want to name drop him because he's probably our top recruit in the last, last few years, Jared Zirkel. He hit a 59-yarder his junior year. He's from San Antonio Kerrville. Tyvee High School, so it's a little further than our domain here, but he's going to Georgia on a full ride. He actually just checked out there two weeks ago to Athens, so he should be taking over, you know, the guy that left with the specs, respect the specs, Rodrigo Blankenship, so that's pretty exciting for us, too. All right, well, Brent, uh, what do you got coming up uh, as, as far as uh, uh, kicking world camps? Uh... Man, yeah, if any of the listeners, you know, I know you got all sorts of positions and parents watching and stuff and coaches, but um, t take a look, August 2nd, night camp. We always do it over at Dragon, so my, my shout-out to end it out would be Coach Cheatham. Yes. Thanks for hooking us up over the years, letting us do the fields over at Round Rock Dragon. Yeah, get Beck Kipperman out there with his Davidson. <laughs> no, no, he can kick, though. Hey, I'll, yeah, he's heading out to college. He's a big dude. I don't think he's kicking anymore, but he's a big lineman. Yes, sure. yeah, he's just going to play lineman on, on the next level. Mm -hmm. Well, Brent, I'm, I'm glad I finally got to, to talk to you. We'll definitely chop it up again. Um, yeah, uh, before we let you go, you shouting out to anybody? I'd say Coach Cheatham at, at Round Rock yes. for all the help over the years. Coach Wood at Westwood. 
Coach Vista that Vista Ridge, and then all my dudes that I coach in the local area, Leandra ISD, Round Rock, etc. I mean, I coach so many kids. So thanks for your, for you know training with me and trusting me. What's that Instagram? Uh, uh, Kicking World. Uh, just at Kicking World. At Kicking World. Yeah, okay. Kicking World. We got all the, all the social media stuff. Yeah, and YouTube we're big on too. Yes, seen that. Brent, appreciate you. I'll talk to you soon. Keep uh, making those yeah, stars. Man, thanks, <laughs> All right, brother. Have okay. a good one. You Take too. Care. Happy 4th of July. Hey, man, you too. That's what's up. Independence Day Eve. How